Hello Virgo, welcome back to the channel. So I'm going to do your energy follow up from now till the end of September. You are going to be the first of my follow up from now till the end of September because well, it is your birthday. So happy birthday. I wish you guys the best. I hope it's the best one yet. Hopefully you guys aren't stuck in a, what is it? hurricane supposedly Nicholas I think we're still on the storm morning right now so I'm gonna do my best to get all your readings up to you guys within the next couple of days or so but the agenda right now is where is this relationship going and what does it mean okay what does it mean to you what does it mean to them where is it headed this is just a little quick bonus reading I like to do for you guys. And this is not a one-on-one -on -one personal reading, but you can most certainly request for one, Virgo, if you guys need it, or cross watchers who you guys um, happen to stop by. Definitely like the video. I know you guys can't comment. I have deliberately turned them off because of all the scammers going around. If you guys need a one-on-one -on -one personal reading with me, Virgo, email me at this time. I have a PayPal link which automatically books your reading. Well, that was the whole point of it. But we're having some technical difficulties at this time with PayPal. I don't know why it's saying user not found. That's a mistake. They, they know about it. They're working on it. They said they'll get back to me within a week or so. Maybe max, maximum, maybe wait time of two weeks, which is a damn long effing time. So, but then I don't know why some people were able to, were able to successfully book without running into any issues. So now it's a weird mystery to me. I don't know what's going on. So if you guys are able to book using the link, all the better. I have a lover special for $33.33 and in the other reading. Well, the other way to book with me would be just to email me. Okay, that's your safest bet, best bet. Just make sure you have the spelling of my email correctly. Just copy and paste. Okay, <clears throat> so what is this relationship? What does it mean and where is it going? How do you guys both feel about each other and the energies that are currently in the making at this time? I'll clarify the energies that I see, Virgo. And let's see whose energy I am picking up at this time. Oh my goodness, Virgo. See, those of you who let me chat my ass off, I do have Gemini placements. I like to talk. Sometimes I'm in the mood to talk. Those of you who did let me talk and didn't already click off, this is going to be the best reading I think I've done yet for Virgo. <sighs> I don't know why I feel it already. The whole overall energy of your reading here is the Ace of Cups. A brand new relationship renewal. Okay, so what is the whole purpose? What was the whole purpose of you meeting them were? What is the purpose of this connection? What does it mean to you and them? How do you guys both feel about each other? The energies that are currently going on at this time. And where is it going? Oh, I told you, I know. There's something shifting. We're talking about a person who you lost contact with, Virgo. In the past, recent or distant, we have the Six of Cups reversed. You know, you were unable to make something work with somebody. Also unable to move on at the same time. You know, there was a constant feeling stuck in the past over something or over someone. If this wasn't you, it's your person's energy. I'm picking up very strongly at this time. Now, this whole relationship here, the energies that I'm picking up, talks about a friendship line that still exists even though you might not believe it. The whole purpose of this connection here was to make you guys see that this relationship here was would transcend the physical. I know that sounds very spiritual, goo goo gaga, but that is what I'm seeing. High Priestess, Two of Swords, King of Swords with the Fool, the Ten of Wands, and the Page of Wands. You guys have felt only stronger for each other in your time and distance apart from each other if that makes any sense when the two of you were together i don't think much got off the ground and if it did it ended up in two conflicts 
Okay, it led to conflicts here between you and somebody. You guys both were very stubborn. Maybe you know, in a way, you didn't want to you didn't want to disclose your feelings to them. You guys were maybe playing cat and mouse. You guys were both probably showing signs of disinterest. Not having any interest for your person. A lack of desire for this relationship to continue in a romantic sense. But there was a line of friendship here that still exists between the two of you. Because the way you guys both still view each other is that... That was a good person. You know, that sounds kind of corny and cheesy. Like, that was a good person. But no, I'm getting here. I told you, this reading here is all about developing feelings here. You haven't spoken to this person is what Spirit showed me in the recent and distant past. The feelings that you guys both have or the feelings they have for you right now energetically is the Three of Cups. So this is talking about that friendship. We're not the Two of Cups. We're not the Ace of Cups. We're not the Ten of Cups. But we're in the Three of Cups. The Three of Cups here is like we still talk to each other. We miss each other. You know, even if we aren't working right now, somehow we get along damn well. You know, somehow we actually really see eye to eye. If we put all the relationship bullshit aside, we actually make a really good team and we are fucking hella funny. We're actually really funny together. We actually enjoy the same things. We get each other. We make a really good team. But what's interesting here is that we're both also kind of attracted to each other. So it kind of makes things a bit difficult. There were a lot of confusion here about you and this person and how to move forward. I'm seeing here there was a stalemate. You know, not much really got off the ground. Nobody really knew how to move this relationship forward. It felt like you two didn't really know how to or what to say about this connection. So it stopped. It ended. They ended things with you. You ended things with them. You guys may have actually gotten into an argument or a fight, but it ended plain and simple it ended king of swords with the ten of wands for the energies that are currently in the making somebody here is being logically decisive trying to be trying to make a head over heart decision about how this relationship should move forward but at the ten of wands they just can't make any damn sense of why they feel so strongly about this relationship anymore logically it just makes utterly no sense just utterly makes no damn sense how the two of you still think about each other. Why are you and them seeing? I'm seeing here. I'm going to clarify. I really get that because we have the end of the reading. We have the King of Cups. <clears throat> this is going to form into a relationship with the Ace of Cups. I'm going to tell you guys that right now, Virgo. This is going to turn into a relationship. I know that's really, um, that's very, that's probably music to your ears, but it's, it's also very hard to say because this is a general reading, but I'm going to tell you guys, this is going to turn into a relationship. to clarify the energies that I see that are currently in the making here spirit show me the two of swords the full reverse the ten of wands and the king of swords you could have been dealing with an Aquarius Libra Gemini I have Cancer Scorpio Pisces here at Taurus Virgo Capricorn Aries Leo Scorpio Sagittarius could be really any sign okay <clears throat> Your feelings about this person has been revived lately. It's almost like you have this feeling, even though you're a bit clueless as to how this might happen, but you have this a little bit of a cockiness about like, yeah, when they see me or when they talk to me again, I think they're going to, I think they feel, there's a feeling here of somebody yeah, to see when they just know that there's something that's going to happen. They're going to be rewarded with this connection. 
Let me take a look at these energy. We have strengthening bonds. We have clarity. We have wanting to reach out to you. We have here wanting to change our focus, observing the signs, the synchronicities, the, the messages here from the universe. They want to reach out to you. New relationships starting. There's clarity or belief on this person. Remember how I told you that they were trying to use a head over heart decision, right? They are trying to mentally block you out because maybe for some reason it doesn't make any freaking sense why... I mean, they blocked you, you blocked them, you guys stopped talking, it didn't work out, but why are they still seeing signs, synchronicity, numbers all over the place? Both of you, and I just did a Virgo reading, personal reading. <clears throat> this is maybe for more than one Virgo, but I know for sure from the energies that I'm seeing, there's her and there's a somebody else here who's a Virgo, coming back together with their twin flame or soulmate. Those strengthening bonds, reconnecting. Somebody here wants to reach out. We have love abounds, and I told you from the get-go of this reading, I told you I saw that. I immediately felt love was in the making of this connection that's where this relationship is going yeah it didn't it also had its downfalls it had met with its conflicts we had the ace of cups there's a lot of off and on stop and goes here and i really do see with the six of cups in your recent or distant past a disconnect even sadness feeling alone feeling like there's no chance there's no way there's no how that we could ever come back maybe you tried but to no avail were you able to get and to see you know or manifest whatever it was that you wanted with this person but all things are changing now whoever was giving will be the one to receive whoever was the receiving will be now the giver there's a change here then she's here shows that it's pretty balanced right now they've had a change of heart all they could see is you, Virgo. All they can think about right now is you. I don't know what it is that you did to this person. But um, this Queen of Pentacles it just flew out. This is you. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, a female, Virgo. Could be another Earth sign that you're dealing with, but you see how your card just flew out here? I'm telling you, I know there's a Virgo in here who's about to get to reckon, have a... Huh? successful reconciliation with their person look at that I'm telling you guys what I just saw here with the ten of cups it's the ten of cups I'm, it's, it's getting it's the same message all the way around if you guys want a personal reading check in with me I hope you guys enjoyed this I enjoyed this reading so much uh, you can reach out to me for a personal reading or I'll see you guys in a couple of days, a couple of weeks. Yeah, this is your end of September reading, so I'll come back um, next month. Bye, Virgo.